Howdy folks, and welcome to the much-anticipated RPG series preview. So now that we're almost finished with the platformer series, this is the next one we're going to be working on. So if you recall from the other RPG series I did, it was a little less uh, modular, the inventory was fairly static and more Zelda-like. This one is going to be more free flow, so you'll just have an empty inventory pack, and then when you pick stuff up, then you can do stuff from there. So you can either like drop it again or equip it. So it'll also be more mo uh, what's the word? Mobile during the combat. So in the first one, she would basically just have to pull her sword out, stand and still. Uh, this time, she'll be able to be on the go. And she'll have more than one attack this time, so we'll set up a combo system. So you'll be able to just attack, attack, etc. Be able to cast magic. Be able to pick up other items. We'll set up how to use them. So when I use it like this, you see it affects our stats. Or you can drop them if you don't need those. You'll be able to change equipment. So if I pick up this sword and this shield, and you see I got a different one, I equip it, it changes. And they have their own stats. We'll make it to where uh, they'll affect the attack based on different things, like, you know, like the swords would in games. So yeah, that's some of what we're going to do. I was setting this up in Unreal Engine 5 because I, made, I, I built a preview in Unreal Engine 4 and then decided to make the jump to 5. I was going to build the whole thing in 5, but I'm ready to just go ahead and get started on these videos. So this is what else we'll be able to do. So we'll set up, see that deer over there? In the first one, it didn't move much. But here... Oh, you're going to make me a liar now. Move. Okay, don't eat grass. Move. There you go. Oh, oh, he spotted me. We'll set up the bow and arrow system so that you can have ranged combat or melee combat. We will, oh. We'll set up different spells. So in the first one, she just had the fireball, but this time you'll have healing spells. This one is like a, a trap spell. So if enemies wander into that zone, then it'll explode. Uh, we'll set up this spell book so that you'll be able to cast different spells. Oh, I'm out of mana. Hang on. So we'll set the spells up so that they're modular. And just to show you, once this thing is fully done, how quickly you'll be able to, like, iterate on top of it. So, like, to add more items to your inventory. Let's say I'm just going to take this. I'm going to duplicate one of my swords real quick. Call it the Dragon Blade. And then in order to just add stuff to your game, all you gotta do all you'll have to do is open it up and then adjust these values, and that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna rename it Dragon Blade, I'm gonna set it. That looks nice. And then its attack is gonna be five hundred, just so you can see in the um in the stats menu how to actually affect it differently and then you just change the mesh so I will set it to that one rotate it around and then place it where I want it that there looks good and then drop it in the world and then there's my new item that I just made that quick so I can equip it now, and you'll see it's that same weapon, and it's got, ooh, it added 500 attack. <laughs> so you'll be able to do that with the items, the equipment, and these are 95% free assets that I'm using. The only thing I'm going to be using that I paid for 
but we'll be using the Infinity Blade assets again and the FX Variety Pack and the Craft Resources, but the only thing I paid for is these textures and these right here just because I want to be able to show you better how the inventory system works but I did find something that y'all can use that is Twitter that can get off Twitter alright so this is a place called opengameart.org and they have all kinds of free assets so if you just go up to the top and search I searched icons and it brought up all of this stuff right here so it's got attack icons and RPG icons, skill items and spells, armor. So just to give you a little preview, see these are all the thing. Oh, uh, that's Kenny. Uh, Kenny is another. They have a lot of free assets, so you should definitely check them out if you're looking for stuff. Uh, they have armor icons, attack, so swords, spells. Look, they have all kinds of stuff for an RPG game. The icons, I don't know what this is. But they have like World of Warcraft looking GUI stuff. All kinds of really cool stuff. Attack icons, look at that, that looks really nice. So yeah, this is, uh, we got just another video, maybe two left in the platformer series. And then we're gonna get started on the RPG series. So with all that said and done, look forward to seeing you there. Bye.